NEC Display Walk Calibrator communicates over TCP IP communication utilizing the LAN interface or RS-232 communication. For the sake of this demo, I'm just going to be calibrating the two right screens here in this 2x2 configuration. There are four main steps when it comes to using our Display Walk Calibrator software. The first is to verify the connections, the second is to initialize all the screens, the third is to measure all the screens, and then the fourth is finally to do the actual calibration. For the sake of this demo, we're going to just be going through the calibration process of this. When looking at the graphical user interface of DisplayWalk Calibrator software, there are four steps that need to be done in order to calibrate the, the video wall. The first step is to verify all the connections. This is going to tell you if all the monitor IDs are set correctly, or if uh, all the IP addresses are set correctly, or if there are any errors in there. The next step is to initialize all the displays. What that's going to do is that's going to increase the brightness that the unit can actually do, and then it's going to reset all the other uh, settings that are within the monitor that would affect the actual picture itself. Uh, this is important because when the brightness of the unit goes all the way up, that's going to, be, that's going to allow us to, to determine what brightness we can measure, that we can calibrate the entire wall to. The next step is to measure all the, all the displays. So when this step is, when this step is being done, uh, each screen is going to be given a set of test patterns that are generated through our display wall calibrator software itself. So no external uh, sources are necessary when do, utilizing this. And then the final step is going to be to calibrate all the units. This is the step that I'm going to show you right now. Uh, again, a bunch of test patterns are going to appear on the screens themselves, and then our, our, we're going to utilize our color sensor to communicate with the software itself and actually calibrate the, the displays. So now we're going to color calibrate our second screen to match the first screen. So again, at this point now, the software itself is communicating with the lookup tables in the second screen now, and it's gonna, it's gonna adjust those lookup tables to match the first screen. So there you go. So now that we've, now that we've calibrated both brightness and intensity of our two units, it creates, creates a better illusion of a, one, of a single image across the entirety of the wall. Uh, for more information on NEC Display Wall Calibrator, you can find it at uh, www.necdisplay.com.